Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy and welcome to some top 100 weekly rewards from the man Joxan who plays for Epsilon Esports. Of course, Joxan is somebody who we've had on uh, the YouTube channel uh, previously in FIFA 18. As we see here, he has the 51st in the world rewards to open. He's a North American player. Uh, who was in the Global Series playoffs in Amsterdam. Unfortunately, he did not make the FIFA E-World Cup, but he was so close to making it. But we're going to open his rewards. Don't forget to check him out in the link in the description below. As you can see, he's got four player picks, one ultimate team of the week, 300k packs, 125k coins, and of course, the qualification points. So before we get into this, don't forget to hit like and also subscribe. But, and like I said, don't forget to check him out so you can learn a thing or two about uh, the team that he has and how he's playing and how he's making top 100 because I think even 19 is a bit different than what we're used to So uh, it's very good to look at the pros and see what they're doing So we'll get into his first player picks and what is he gonna select here? He's got oh yeah, how it is but The best player is King so we're recording this he recorded this video on his PlayStation and we're gonna react to it live uh, This is the first time I'm seeing his rewards and the first one is not good. I'm sure he's going to go for maybe Howardus because Howardus does have the highest rating. And of course, you can use it for SBCs. Again, the thing with these, the new way that they're doing rewards is, I mean, you don't get as many players. And I think the thing about rewards was you could use a lot of these players to get some SBCs. Like, for instance, uh, POTM Hazard just came out. So a lot of the unused reds that you would have would normally go towards someone like a POTM Hazard or... A prime icon, but now that you don't get that many choices, I mean, what are you gonna do? So he's actually gonna go with King. I was very surprised by that. I thought he would go with Howardus for the rating, but he goes with King. So interesting choice. Maybe he feels that like he can actually use that player as like a super sub because King really isn't that bad in the game. Second player pick, Imaz, Ospina, Alcatha. These, honestly, from the rewards I've seen so far, the reward system is a bit weird. Because I, I'm surprised that you can't get... I'm surprised that it's not 81 plus. I think it's a bit shocking that it's not 81 plus. I think last year, if you were top 100, you were guaranteed an 81 plus player from the packs, right? Like, that's what the guarantee was. But in this one, it doesn't seem like the case at all. As you can see, he gets a 78 rated, so... From what I'm seeing from the reward so far, let me know in the comments below if you agree. He picks 82 Hoffman there. Um, for the people that actually get top 100, I actually don't think it's very good. Let's see his third player pick. Four is Paco Alcantara again. Oh my god, he's getting killed. He's got another 78 there, Bamba. Um, I think if you're a casual player, these work out a lot better for you. You know, you 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 on a weekly basis, you get better players for your team you get like decent players for your team to be upgrading every week but i think if you are like elite and higher top 100 player i don't think you will benefit too much because from what i've seen so far the top 100 guys have been absolutely shafted with the player picks i mean i saw gorillas rewards and they were so bad i think i've seen a lot i've there's very few people, I mean, like in this week, you, the, the real good player you can get is Mbappe, right? Other than that, it's like, I don't know. Uh, let's see what he gets here. Forest, Delict, King. I, look at this. Oh, my Lord. This is so... This is. I feel bad for him. I actually feel bad for him. He really got King twice. He's going to take Delict, obviously, right? I think he's obviously going to take Delict. But yeah, everybody I've seen from like Elite and higher, it has not seemed that great. But if I was like a gold three player, like... I got gold three and I got just about the same rewards he's getting. He got top 100, if I'm being honest with you, right? Um, I think it's bad if you're a top 100 player. So now we're going to take a look at the team that he uses to get top 100. I can see it here, 4 3 2 1. I'm guessing he switches to 4 1 2 and 2 narrow or 4 2 3 1, depending on the situation. He's got Varon, Ramos, and Corto. That's a good back three. Uh, with Mendy, Fernandino, Valencia, and uh, Marshall. And I wonder if he uses. If he uses 4 2 3 1, he can go with the two CDMs as Conte and Fernandinho, and then maybe he goes like Hyungman Son or Mbappe up top. And or any one of Neymar, I think Neymar, Mbappe, and Marshall on the wings, or he goes 4 2 1 2 narrow, and then maybe he has Marshall as one of the wingers, I guess the CM, uh, and then Fernandinho at CDM. So we'll take a look at his goals to games ratio. He's got a very good ratio there with Mbappe. He's got 57 goals, 
uh, 36 assists, sorry, and 68 games there. And his Neymar, my goodness, he's got 78 goals in 67 games. So maybe he uses Neymar up top, 53 assists as well. I wonder what he's got with his Hyungman son, because he seems like the kind of player that would like a Hyungman son and use him up top as well. He's got 104 goals and 91 games with Hyungman son with 52 assists. And that is pretty impressive. You got Hyungman son for 60K. Of course, he is on the PlayStation. Uh, I found that Hyungman has high, high work rate. So we'll go out and now we're going to take a look at the packs that he is going to open for the rest of his rewards. So we're going to start off with the 100K pack. His first 100K pack. What is going to be in this? Oh, it's a walkout. Germany. How it is? Oh, God. Getting how it is probably feels like the worst thing. I mean, you got a 55 pace left back. Who the hell would want that? 85 defending, 77 physical. This is SBC fodder. Uh, I was looking at the requirements for Hazard. Like, and literally, like, uh, if you guys know, it's the the background in my uh, my place is different. I'm away for a wedding. My cousin's getting married. But I was able to look at the requirements for the SBC Hazard. And it looks like you do need some inform. So maybe how it is is a good player to use for those uh for that sbc in particular so hopefully he can use it towards that i don't know if i'm doing hazard or not to be honest with you because i know hazard is going to have a lot of informs hazard is hot right now hazard is on probably the best form of his life so i think Hazard's he's probably going to get another info by the end of the year all right he's got jovico davies the kool-aid that is not a great pack i think hazard's gonna get another info by the end of the year if not um oh fernandinho as well that's not a bad pack with potm be careful when you do a POTM for a player who's like looking like he's gonna be the best player one of the best players in the league I Would stay away from that because I did which year was it that I did POTM hazard? He got like so many more infos right after so like is it really worth it? Especially because it looks like hazards gonna cost like I was looking at the POTM. It look, looks like it costs like 600k um, So I don't know if he's worth it. I'm not gonna do it I might do it for the packs, but I don't think I'll do it for the player so we're gonna move on to his second 100k pack and let's see what he can get in that hopefully another walkout if we are lucky is there ah no it's not a walkout oh that's gonna be bad what's it gonna be at least um Mares? lm who's that oh Bra uh, brahimi yeah 85 brahimi i mean that's a good rating but that's nothing crazy uh hopefully get something else in the pack Javi Martinez as well, Lamar, Memphis, and Dembele. That's not the worst pack. I mean, that's 100K, but that's not the worst pack you've ever seen as 100K. I mean, I've got... I, I opened a 50K pack once, and the highest player was like 80 rated, so I don't think that's too bad. Okay, time for his last 100K pack before we go to the Ultimate Team League. He still has a chance to get Mbappe. That's what we're hoping for. Or he could pack Mbappe. Let's see what's here. Oh, it's a walkout. Mbappe, Mbappe, please, please, please. Please, Mbappe. Spain. Ramos? Oh, Aspilicueta. That's not bad. That's not bad. 86 Aspilicueta. I think he goes for... That's about 50k. Let's see what's in the rest of the pack. Sanho. Rashford's about 30k, I want to say. Yeah, Rashford's like 30k. That's how you know I've been trading a lot. Like, I, I, I know some of these player prices to the T. Okay. Time for the last team of the week pack. What is it going to be for the man, Jackson? It's a board. I mean, it's a walkout. Who's it going to be? If it's... Oh, it's how it is again. Are you joking? Yo, people are getting... Top 100 players are getting the the business from EA. I don't know, man. I, I haven't seen too many. I think Foot was Dubs. Not, he's not Foot was anymore. Sorry. Dubsy was probably the only guy with, like, really good rewards, in my opinion. Uh, other than that, I haven't seen the best rewards from top 100 people. Like I was saying before, if you're a casual player, I think this reward structure does benefit you a lot more. But if you're a top 100 and elite, like top level player, I don't think this is a... I'm not sure from what I've seen so far that it's super beneficial for you. So I wonder if they're going to make any changes. He's got Ospina, Pop. Oh my god. Stuani, that is bad. Is it just because it's a bad team of the week? But that's the thing, like, what if, what about those weeks of Team of the Week is crap? It's going to be crap rewards. What happens when the league stop? you know? Do they go to Team of the Seasons? Who knows? Let me know in the comments below what you guys think about the new rewards system. If you like it or not, uh, let me know also what you guys got in your rewards 
Um, I had a separate video that for some reason got copyright blocked from some random Serbian youth channel. It's been blocking a lot of rewards for some other players, Tim Laka, uh, Roma Randers as well. So apologies for that video for getting taken down. Hopefully by the time I upload this, it's back up again. But big thank you to Joxan from Epsilon Esports for letting us open his rewards. Go follow him in the description below, who will hopefully be opening his rewards for a while. Um, he's a great NA player. He has been going so far in FIFA 18. Hopefully FIFA 19 is his year. It looks like it's his year because he's already got a top 100. Hopefully there's more top 100s coming for the boy. All right, so we'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Peace.